Hey guys, welcome. This is Deepika from mytutorialrack.com and in this video we are going to create our custom object which is going to store all the employee information and we are also going to add fields to this custom object. You know how to add fields to the custom object. You know how to create a custom object and I've already shown you all the fields that needs to be created on this object so if you want to do it on your own you're welcome to do so and you can skip this video and go to the next video but if you want to see me how i do it just feel free to do that as well so what i'm going to do is i'm going to log in to my salesforce org that i just created which is this employee source app at mytutorialrack.com and i'm going to log into this one and over here i am going to go to the object manager and I will create a brand new object here and I will call this as employee HR data. This is what I'm going to call it and plural label we can call it as the same. This is employee HR data and this is going to be employees HR data and if you scroll down we are going to have employee number and that is going to start with EN and the format is going to be 000 and the starting number is going to be 1 and we are going to allow all these features and then allow search and I'm going to have a custom tab as well I'm going to hit the save here I'm going to provide the style of the tab and I'm going to choose airplane next it's up to you next and then visibility next I'm going to include it in every different application and hit save, okay? So what I've done is I have created the employee HR data object. I have a quick joke for you. What did one toilet say to another? You look flushed. Oh, no, 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 no. And now I'll be adding fields to that object. So the first field that I'll be adding is, if you go back, we're going to add the employee first name. Okay, so we're going to add two fields, one to capture the first name and the other one to capture the last name. And uh, I'm going to keep the length as 50. So here, new text, and here I'll call it as first name. Length is 50, and that's it. Hit next, visible next save and new the next field that i'll add is the last name so i'm going to choose the text again hit next i'll call it as last name the length i will leave it as 50 again and next visible next save and new now the third field that I will add is the salary okay so I'm going to choose the type as currency here and scroll next and then here I'll call it as salary and we will make it as length of 10 zero decimal places next visible next save and new next field would be the date of birth so I'm going to choose date here next and then date of birth and next visible next and save and new and if i go here you can see we have first name we have added the employee number is the auto number we have added last name we have added salary and we have added date of birth the only next thing we'll add is the employee id and this is going to be a seven digit long it's a text field and we'll keep it unique okay so this is the last field that i'm going to add it's going to be a text field and hit the next here and i'll call this as employee id so this employee id is different from the record id okay don't get confused here and number seven and next and visible to all next here and here I'm going to say save. So if I go over to the employee HR data here, you can see if you try to create a new record, 
you will see all those fields okay so if I try to click here on the new you will see all these fields are there first name last name salary date of birth and employee ID now in the next video we are going to load data into this object using Salesforce inspector I have already added the sheet with the which data needs to be added you can add your own employees data it's up to you I have just given you an example that you can use for your reference and you can use Salesforce inspector data import to import those records into this object okay but how do I do it I'll show you in the next video so I'm going to see you then and till then take care